really don't know what Christmas is all about. Isn't there anyone who knows what Christmas is all about? It's not roasting Like frost nipping at your nose We're gonna wait on this camera to stop shaking What is up you guys and welcome to Christmas with the K And it is Vlogmas Day 15 a 15 gang gang in the week of three y'all i know i look a hot mess so we're just gonna hop right into it so y'all already know why the title so let's get into it our first tiktok is i'm gonna play it as well as pop it up on the screen for you guys so you can see and i'll be watching them on my laptop since my other phone is cracked i've seen multiple people do this also before i get started i'm also going to be doing a lot of these in combination with each other because they kind of overlap each other so i'm going to be doing a few yeah here we go first one if you wear makeup watch change your whole routine and try this instead Moisturize first, then after moisturizing, take some translucent powder. I usually use the Fit Me one, and I just lightly dab it all over my face, not too much. Then take some setting spray, it could be any setting spray, I usually use the NYX one. After the setting spray, take a primer and just put your primer. Also, wait for the setting spray to dry first. Then just put on your foundation and just see All right, so this hack basically says you moisturize first, then you put on translucent powder, then you spray setting spray, let that dry. Then on top of that, add primer, then go in with your foundation. And apparently it's supposed to have you snatch. Your skin is supposed to be flawless and your makeup is supposed to last all day long. So we're gonna test that out today and see if it actually works. So let's hop into it. Also, I probably should do my brows first cause I didn't really find any brow hacks. So maybe I should do that. I'm gonna do that real quick and then I'll come back. <laughs> let's get into it. Mm. So as y'all can see, I did my brows already. Brows are done, filled in. They don't look the best, but that's not what this video is about. So we gonna ignore that, okay? Can we ignore that together? Okay, okay, thank you. Thanks for having my back. I'm just gonna use this L'Oreal Revival Lift Moisturizer. It's the only thing that I have here. That's what I'm gonna use. And I'm gonna just take a little bit. And so I could said it said some moisturize first. So we moisturizing. This already feels mad weird. I moisturize after I wash my face. I don't moisturize before I do my makeup because I don't always wash my face right before I do my makeup. So it's weird. Move on. <laughs> and then it says use translucent powder. I don't have a translucent powder, but I do have this baking powder. Yo, what are you talking about? But it does also say just use a little bit. So I think it'll be fine. This is like tinted as you guys can see. We're going to work with it. I'm gonna go on top with just a little bit of this baking powder. Okay, whatever you say. I'm trusting you. I'm putting my faith in you, girl. So if I come out looking hood ratchet, at least I'm not going nowhere. Still, like, you gonna have me out here looking toe up from the flow up? Like, what the fuck? Christmas is all about. We got that on. I think this is enough. How much exactly I'm supposed to use, but I'm guessing this is enough. That's done. The next step is with a setting spray. Y'all know I like mixing products, okay? Literally every step of my routine, I mix stuff. So I'm gonna mix my Wet n Wild Photo Focus. This is the matte one with my e.l.f. Glow. I know, it's kind of like counterintuitive, but I like mixing them, okay? Don't judge me. So we're gonna take some of this. I hate these pumps though. They're so cheap. After a while, you have to like lift it. Why did I still have my eyes closed? Fuse, let's she said to make sure that this is dry before you move on to the next step it feels pretty dry so the next step i like to mix my primers i'm gonna take the ciate london water burst hydrating primer mixed with my no pore blum which i'm running out of so i need to get a new one 
I don't need too much. We're gonna rub this in. If you didn't say to go in with a brush with the primer or just to blend it out with your fingers or... So far, it doesn't really feel weird. So far though, that's so far. It doesn't feel different as far as like the texture of the primer going on. Everything else, of course, was kind of weird, but like texture of the primer doesn't feel any different. I thought it may feel like weird because of the powder. I mean, it feels fine. Nothing different so far. So now the next step was to to do your foundation but this is where we get a little tricky i saw another hat sis i'm about to change your hope that so instead of putting concealer and bronzer on after your foundation we're gonna do it before the key is to use a concealer that is much lighter than you would typically use. Okay. I'm gonna take your beauty blender and I like to use something to wet it. I don't use water. I like to use the Dewy Set Spray by Anastasia Beverly Hills and we're gonna... I'm dramatic, I know. You're going to look like you just dumped your face in a bag of flour. That's okay. Now you're going to take a liquid bronzer shade that is much darker than you would typically use. At this point, you're probably gonna scare yourself a little bit, but that's also okay. At this point, you should definitely be questioning me. Put your foundation on like you would normally do. This is what it looks like after foundation is on. So as y'all saw, this one's a little weird. That's weird. That's suspicious. I'm gonna take my Tarte Shape Tape. I don't really even like this concealer, but it's the only one that I really have that's light. So it said first to take a concealer that's way lighter than what you would normally use. So this is the Tarte Shape Tape in deep or tan deep sand. It says to apply on the face. Okay, this is scary. This is getting a little spooky, mamas. So everywhere that you would normally apply, concealer as if it's over top of your foundation okay and then it said to take your beauty blender and blend it in i have a sony cash sponge so that's what i'm gonna use and it says to spray it and dampen it with something besides just water and she said i think she said the anastasia dewy setting spray i don't have that so i'm just gonna use my elf glow dewy mist so we're gonna blend this in Honestly, this concealer isn't that light. I don't really think it'll do much for me. I mean, it's light, but y'all know I like my concealers to be light anyways. So I'm gonna blend that. So as far as this hack goes, I'm not really seeing anything crazy other than the fact that it's a lighter concealer. But with this hack, you're not supposed to really see what's supposed to happen until the very end. As far as the first hack goes, why am I liking this concealer all of a sudden? Like, I really don't like the Tarte Shape Tape. I'm not minding it too much right now. Okay. I see you TikTok. Now we're gonna move on. It said to take a, I'm sorry the sun is literally setting while I'm filming this. I am so sorry. Next it says to take a, a contour shade that's darker than what you would use. This is just the ELF foundation palette, the deep one. And I'm just taking my Away Studios F5 brush. I'm scared, actually. I think this might have messed me up. I'm not even gonna lie. <laughs> Isn't this beautiful? So now that I've gotten the thumbnail, I'm just gonna take this same brush. This is how I normally blend in my contour though. So I don't really know why this is tripping, but um, we're just gonna go with it, okay? She said what she said, so. Doesn't really look like it's blending. I literally look a hot mess. Holy craz, craz. Y'all, yeah. why well, I look like I went outside, got some dirt on my hands, and smudged it on my face. Like, that's literally what I look like. TikTok got me messed up because why you got me looking like this? She said, apply your foundation with a brush like you normally would. I look crazy. Like, y'all oh my gosh okay these better work out because i'm wasting my good makeup for this no, I'm just but like why i look like this though why i look like this Ugh. i look dirty like for real especially my nose it's the nose for me it's the nose for me go over with your normal foundation and blend that in and apparently your face your base is supposed to look chef's kiss so we're gonna move we're gonna put these two together i'm gonna use my maybelline fit me with my pro filter fenty this is in 360 and this is in 420 this is my everyday foundation mixture i don't want y'all to think that i'm like sabotaging these tiktoks if they worked out for you guys if they didn't work out they just didn't work out because i actually use this stuff i can tell you what christmas is all about that's not roasting y'all they set me up there's no way because what the heck 
Oh no. Oh no, baby. Oh no. This ain't it. Are my eyes deceiving me? Or did the video deceive me? Because what the heck is this? This ain't cute, baby. This is not it. This is not cute. I just look like I have way too much makeup on my face. Like, the forehead is done for. Do y'all see? I look muddy. Like, I just look like I have way too much makeup on my face. Y'all, and I promise y'all, I know how to do makeup pretty decently. I mean, watch some of my other content or something. Because I know how to do my makeup. But I don't know what this is. I don't know what this is. Okay, so the base actually looks good. I just don't think that the second TikTok worked. I think the other two have worked so far, but the second one, maybe I just didn't have like the right shades. But as far as like the foundation goes, our base in general, I think my skin does look pretty nice actually. Like it looks really good. My skin looks really smooth and I haven't been having the best skin lately. Like I've had tons of breakouts recently. Surprisingly, the base looks pretty smooth for the most part. So that's good. But like I said, I don't think that the second one worked for me because at this point, I just kind of look like I have way too much makeup on my face and for no reason because that step didn't do anything for my face. All right, you guys. So overall, these TikToks weren't really like life-changing TikToks. I'm not going to change my entire makeup routine for some of these TikToks. To be honest, I don't really see myself changing my entire routine to suffice some of these TikToks. It just wasn't that game changing but they were pretty nice things that you may just want to try out just to see the difference but there weren't crazy differences to where i would be like this is literally detrimental to my makeup routine like i could never go back to doing my makeup any other way it just wasn't that but as you guys can kind of make out my makeup did turn out pretty decent for the most part but i do favor my routine better that's pretty much it for these tiktok makeup hacks i hope you guys enjoyed be sure to like comment and subscribe down below i do have a giveaway going on so make sure that you tune in to other videos previous videos to get all the information on those i have 25 giveaways going on all through my vlogmas today's question will be would you like to see more makeup content i used to do a lot more beauty content but since going off to college and then vlogmas of course i've been into more just like vlogging and like lifestyle type videos but let me know what you guys would like to see because makeup will forever be my passion so if you guys want to see more makeup content i will be more than happy to provide that for you guys but yeah so that's pretty much it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed be sure to like comment and subscribe down below and i will see you guys in my next one bye guys all right, you guys. So actually, I don't know if it was because I was in the dark before or what, but I actually really don't like my makeup right now. I just think it looks super cakey. It looks super cakey, but like it's smooth at the same time. Everything just looks really weird. But can y'all see? I don't know what it is, but I don't really like it. I just, what it is, but I don't like it like at all. So I'm actually going to go and wash my face right now. But I mean, that's tea. That is tea.